week's breeding focus, if you hadn't already guessed it, is the Golden Retriever. These adorable creatures were originally developed in Scotland as sporting dogs in the late 19th century to retrieve waterfowl. <laughs> They're placid sometimes. You reckon? <laughs> Friendly and brimming with joy. They're great with children and tend to get along with other pets. They're intelligent and eager to please, and this, along with their love for work, is why we see them in so many service and therapy dog roles. In contrast, they aren't really considered much of a guard dog, no. given their love of people. <laughs> and because of their strong bond with their family, they thrive on being included in family activities inside and outside of the home. So if you aren't willing to fully embrace them in your life, and activities on your lap and have plenty of food, then they're not for you. They are highly intelligent and have a strong desire to work. So they love obedience training and they excel at dog sports. Absolutely. The Golden <laughs> Retriever likes to be active and given their history, they can spend hours at the park or beach playing fetch or romping around in the water. They do need a decent amount of daily exercise and as long as they're kept active and have daily outings, they can do well in any sized home or apartment. Their stunning water resistant double coat is perfect for the love of water. And as an average shedder, a brush once or twice a week will keep their flowing locks looking luscious. As you can see, they range from shades of cream through to deep gold, and often the tips of a puppy's ears will indicate what their final colouring will be as an adult. And talking about puppies, don't expect your golden retriever to mature mentally or physically as early as other breeds. If ever. <laughs> Whilst they are generally at their full height at one year of age, they don't hit their full weight until they're about two or three. And most keep their playful puppy personality for much of their life, with their average lifespan being about 10 to 15 years. Like the Labrador Retriever, Goldens love their food, so you'll need to watch their weight to keep them healthy. Yes. <laughs> Absolutely, especially as they are prone to hip and elbow dysplasia, so any excess weight will place added pressure on their bones and joints. Recent studies have also shown that delaying desexing in this breed has significant benefits for long-term health, including joint disease. Your vet will be able to guide you with this decision. They can also suffer from eye problems, including entropion, where the eyelid rolls inwards, causing irritation and potential corneal ulcers, as well as progressive retinal atrophy, or PRA, and cataracts. Ear infections and hypothyroidism can also be a problem. An inherited heart disease known as subaortic stenosis is prevalent in the breed. Affected dogs are usually young in age and often have a reduced lifespan. That's why it is so important to choose a breeder that screens their puppies and provides certificates showing they have been tested and are clear of disease. Plus, always research the breed you're considering mm. thoroughly so that you can be prepared and know what to look out for. <laughs> That's right. What do you think? You have cleaned my hand. Thanks for that. <laughs> <laughs> to find out how HIF Pet Insurance can help your pet in times of need, visit hif.com.au.